I love masks. You put one on, and it changes who you are. You can be goofy. You don't need a mask for that. Or glamorous. Dreaming. Or mysterious. Mysterious? Got any masks that'll make you look taller? No, but I have one that might make you sick. <laughs> I like those clear masks that change your face just a little bit. Way creepy. The thing about masks is that they let you be whatever you want to be. Underneath, you're still you, but no one can tell because they can't see behind the mask. My story is about the horror of losing what's behind the mask. Huh? Behind every mask is the one thing that makes you different from everyone else. Your personality. But if you lose it, no one would know you. No one would care. You'd be all alone and forgotten. Submitted for the approval of the Midnight Society, I call this story. The Tale of Many Faces. Okay, Emma, mon amour. Okay, it's a cold fall day, but your sweater keeps you so very warm. Yes? No, 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 no. Pretend it's your birthday. You're excited. You smile. Yes? No, okay, this will not do. Next girl, please. But I could... No, no, no. Next girl. Next girl. Come on, go faster. Beat, beat, beat. S'il vous plaît, merci. Okay, so cold day, hot sweater, right? Oui. Okay, and help this. You're excited. You smile. Yes, yes, yes. That is wonderful. I like it. Yes, yes, yes. Beautiful. A little bit more, a little bit more. More lips, more eyes. You think wind in your hair. Turn, turn, spin. Oh, c'est beau, c'est beau. Plus comme ça. Oui, c'est beau. C'est super. Okay, enough. Enough. I have made my final decision. I have found our spree sweater girl. Jesse? Yes. Yes, you like? Yes, it is perfect. But a smile. Love it. Yes? Yes. Are you okay? Sure. Hey, congratulations. You'll get the next one. With this face? Not likely. Don't say that. You're beautiful. Yeah, right. Since when is thin lips and a big nose beautiful? But you are beautiful. You have the cheekbones of a Russian princess and the eyes of an Egyptian queen. Have you thought about performing in the theater? Thought about it? I dream about the theater. Who are you? A talent scout for the Madame Visage Theater Company. Go to that address, see if you like it. Are you serious? Very. Good luck. That was weird. Are you gonna go? I don't know. What have I got to lose? Hello? Anybody here? Excuse me. Hey, wait. What do you want? I'm here to see Madame Visage. Someone gave me this? What's with the mask? We're rehearsing a play. Oh, cool.
Madame will be with you shortly. Thanks. student of theatre? Well, sort of. I got this... You are stunning. Indeed. Come sit. Look to the left, please. Yes. Very nice. What? Look out, as if to the ocean. It is a lonely, misty day, and you're sad. Lovely, Emma. Just lovely. How did you know my name? Your face would be perfect for the lead role in my new play. The lead? For real. But only after the right preparation. Are you willing? Of course. What do I have to do? My theater is known the world over for presenting the most lovely faces to ever grace the stage. But raw beauty is just the start. This powder was developed over 300 years ago. It conditions the skin and gives it the most amazing properties. Is that what you use? Your skin is beautiful. It almost glows. Ah, glow is the right word. When your skin is prepared with this powder, stage lighting is almost unnecessary. Here, try some. frequently and then come back tomorrow and we shall begin our adventure all right great thank you I can't wait we're waiting where is she Wonderful, loving it, yes, yes, beautiful, that's it, that's it, yes, okay. Remove the hat, please, no dawdling. Hey, nice sweater. Thanks. So, how did it go at that theater? I'm not gonna believe this. They want me to be the lead in there. Jesse, mon amour, we will set up a... Hello. Hi. Do you model? I auditioned for you yesterday. No, 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 you did not. I did. She did. What was I thinking? Uh, May I? Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, yes, yes. Yes, yes. Oh. Give her a scarf. Hurry, hurry. Yes, yes. Wonderful. Yes, okay. Look at me like I'm a bonbon. You are hungry. I can. Yes, yes. Perfect. Yes, I love it. How I missed it, I do not know. I'm such an imbecile. Hey, so beautiful. I love your smile. Yes, perfect. Way to go, Emma. Okay. Okay. I have decided. You must be the next spree cover girl. Cover girl? Oui, oui. Come, come. You will be undercover of one million catalogues wearing the brand new line of spree clothing. <laughs> Jacques a flake. But he's right. You look different. Did you take some kind of magic potion or something? <laughs> sort of. Madame Visage gave me this powder. She said. It's got properties. And who's Madame Visage? From the theater. She wants me to play the lead in her next play. Cool, huh? Yeah. <laughs> anyway, off to the theater. <laughs> Ta. Ta. 
And he told me I'm going to be on the cover of a million catalogs. Turn to the right, please. Isn't that great? Mm hmm? Oh, yes, of course. To the left. Spectacular. She is ready. What's the play they're rehearsing? Rehearsing? Oh, this is no rehearsal. What's this? These are my other faces. Oh, you mean the other actresses you've worked with? You might say that. Maybe I'll be in there someday. Sooner than you think. Hey! My new play. Welcome to my theater group. You'll be number 94. What? Names aren't allowed. I'm 87. But, but my face. Madame Visage has it now. It's better this way. Trust me. Anybody here? Hello? Anybody here? Emma? Oh, Emma. Don't be mad, please. Why would I be mad? Well, it's just that after what happened to you, I sort of followed you here so I could meet with this, um, Madame Visage. I'm not mad. Hmm. What's with the feathers? We're rehearsing. Oh. So, can you introduce me to her? Of course. Come with me. She took their faces. Why? How? Madame's power is ancient. The faces keep her young. Everyone, this is 94. But she doesn't steal faces just to stay young. She wants them for her plays. This is where we make her costumes. And why doesn't anyone stop her? Madame is too powerful. If you displease her, she'll expel you. And you'd have to live outside. Can't be worse than here. No? Go outside and see how people look at you. This is horrible. There's one thing more horrible. The punishment book. Punishment book? Working here is a joy compared to being banished there. If you're sent to the punishment book, you'll never be seen again. Wait in here. Oh. Hey, do you think I can use some of Madame Visage's powder? Of course. Oh, cool. Use as much as you'd like. What did you look like? I'd rather not talk about it. But you have to. It was you. What color were your eyes? Um, blue. I bet you had a nice smile. I did. I could show you if you want. How? It's in the book with all the others. But if Madame catches us... I want to see what you look like.
It's me. What's your name? We're forbidden to use names. I don't care. My name's Emma. I'm Lizzie. I haven't said that in a long time. The hardest thing is that no one can tell you apart from anyone else. But it gets worse. No one can see how you feel. If you're angry or sad or happy, it's like you're not there. Pretty soon you stop feeling altogether. I don't want to stop feeling. I want to get out of here. What's in there? Nothing. We should go. Why is it locked? What are you doing? I was just It's sorry. forbidden to touch the book. I'm sorry. I won't do it again, I promise. Leave Lizzie alone. We don't use names here. I'm taking you to Madame. No, I'll be good, I promise. Back up! 94. I'm not 94. My name is Emma. And I'm gonna see what's in that cabinet. You'll both be punished for this. Hey, you locked me in. Sorry. Are you using the powder? Yes, it's amazing. This won't take long at all. Madame, you better come now. <laughs> She's creepy. Why did she call you Madame? Part of the play. Wait here. Use more of that powder. Don't! It's the punishment book! This is horrible. What's this? I've never seen it before. Who is this? They're here. They're in the inner sanctum. Hurry, Emma, I'm scared. Is there another way out of here? Yes, but they'll get us. Show me. Stop right there. Wait, I have an idea. Where's the costume room? Down here. I'm not going to run. That would be very wise. Now give me the book. Or your punishment will be more severe than you could ever imagine. You can't steal people's faces. You've been doing it for centuries. All these lives are mine. No, they're not. You have our faces, but you can't take away who we are. The face is who you are. No, it's not. And I'm gonna stop you right here. No! <laughs> you think my power can be destroyed that easily? You've been watching too much television. Take them to my chamber. Now. The question is, what would be a fitting punishment? This is getting weird, Emma. I want to leave. That's not me, Jesse. Okay, now I really want to leave. Bring me the punishment book. Let this be a lesson. 94 and 87 disobeyed my rules. And they will be banished forever. Stop! I'm not 94. My name is Emma. And her name is Lizzie. You all have names. You have friends and families. Try to remember. What's your name? What about you? What's your name? Linda, Rachel, Robin? Listen to me. She took your faces. She didn't take who you are. You're, you're still in there. It doesn't have to be this way. My name is Lizzie. I have a brother named Bill and a dog named Maggie. Silence! My name's Kayla. Good. Who are you? I'm Hillary. I miss my parents. 
quiet. None of you are to speak again. Bring me the punishment book! You will not defy me. I own you all. Okay, now this is getting bad. Now, Troublemaker, it's your turn. The faces are mine, the girls are mine, and no one's going to take them from me. Stop! My name is Lorette, and you don't own me. Oh, dare you? Listen to me. You'll all be punished. Take her. Do as I say. I own you. I own you all. What should we do? I think it's time we gave Madame Visage her own face back. No. You can't do that. It's not my face anymore. It's 300 years old. you. Madame used my face to lure you here. I'm sorry. Emma? Lizzie! <laughs> we're back. No, it's like you said. We were always here. <laughs> so it doesn't matter what mask you wear. Beneath it, you're still you, and no one can take that away. I said, the end. Okay, now you're creeping me out. Guys, guys, stop! Story. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny. 